Okay, hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be filming a feeding my tarantulas gummy worm video. Now, you know, I'm just saying, you now these aren't really gummy worms. I'm just, just some of some of us tarantula people are calling gummy worms. These are actually horn worms, which are larvae of some kind of moth or something. But anyways, um, I'm not going. I promise you that you're going to get to see every single transfer in this video, but we're trying our best. So, first of all, I'm going to start off with my Ceratogyrus Darlingi. I hope it don't bolt back into its hide. This is an old world transfer. I do have a bit of significant venom, so I have to be a little bit careful around these guys, but I hope he gets it, but. Yeah, if he does not get it soon, then let's move on. Because we have like six, seven more things to show in today's video. So sorry, you don't have a pause button on this, but let's move on to the next one. But yeah, it's my Sotokaiba Stolingi, or the real horn baboon tarantula. Okay, next up is my Solar Pace Cambridge enclosure or the Trinidad Chevron. You drop it in a gummy worm, they usually eat pretty good. This one does. Oh, nice. Well, it's out of focus. Yeah, there he is. Kind of seen him down there. Very pretty tarantula, so let's move on to the next one. Ready, this next one just recently molted. This is my um chromatic helmet cyber The green bottle blue tarantula. That's its molt over there. And let's just drop it in one and see if he eats it or not. See I don't know what he's eating at. Oh I see him. Well she's probably not gonna get it for us on camera today, but just that's just how it is, but yeah, I'm not going to spend too much more time on him, so we move on to the next tarantula. Okay, next one is my grandma store a polka thing. And I'm going to drop it in one. Yeah, this is kind of a slow growing species, but definitely very cool. It's kind of a big meal for him, but. Yeah, he's probably going to get it soon. Or not. Well, at least you guys get to see them today, so see at least some of my tarantulas. So. I see, there we go. See the fangs there? Definitely very cool. Let's on. And move on to the next thing. Okay, this next one is not a tarantula. This is actually my yellow ground scorpion. I don't think it's going to eat for us, but never know. We're going to give it a try. Just grab one real quick. Yeah, this is definitely a pretty cool species, you know. I'd say this is a nice sub-adult specimen, so it shouldn't get very much bigger than this. So yeah, let's move on to the next one. Okay, this is my Brachypelma albiceps. Or the Mexican Golden Red Rump Tarantula. So yeah, let me just try to get one real quick. Yeah, this is pretty cool species. You know, there's two of them here, but I'm in here. Nice. Looks like he got at least one of them, so. Yeah, this is pretty good beginner species, in my opinion. They can be a little bit skittish. Yeah, so that's just something to kind of keep in mind, but yeah, like I said, this one looks like it's going to a pre molt, so. Move on to next transfer. We only have two more to go.
Okay, this next one is my Brucky Palma Mori or Smithy or some kind of red tarantula. I don't know the exact species to it. So if you guys know what he is, put it down in the comments below. Um, it's hard to tell the Brucky Palma Mori and Brucky Palma Smithy apart, so I'm just going to drop in a small one for him. Keep in mind, these are kind of small meals for some of these. Nice, yeah. This, one, this one's usually a pretty good eater, so... Yeah, let's move on to our last tarantula. Okay, sorry if you can't see very good, but last, but most certainly not least, is my Telecatul Brudesi, or the Mexican Rosy Gray tarantula. It's a pretty cool one, you usually got a pretty good appetite too. So let's drop it in gummy worm and see what it says. Let's see what it does, I mean. Yeah, it's kind of what I expected. Pretty good appetite on this, so yeah. If you guys like this video, let me know. Hopefully, I can do another one. And um, yeah, thank you for watching, and see you guys in the next episode.